What is going on guys, welcome to Toso, and today I'm here to talk about uh, uh, just, uh, just, just, just a couple of Now as you've noticed, um, it's been about 10 days since I last uploaded, sorry. Last this past Thursday, I celebrated my 23rd birthday. Yes, your boy is now 23 years old. I know, it's hard to believe. I mean, my ass is getting fucking old, and, I, and, and you know... <laughs> Truth be told, I just wanted to give myself a couple of days, you know? I, I, I knew my birthday was coming up, I had ideas planned for it, but all of them just kind of went kaput. And ultimately, I was just like, well, what if I just did nothing for my birthday, for the weekend, up until this point? And that's exactly what I did. I doodled some stuff here and there, played around with some video ideas here and there, but ultimately, I just really enjoyed myself. And just had a great, great, great time being old. I woke up that morning with no plans at all. You know, I went into the bathroom, did my my, my daily duties. You know, <laughs> went out <laughs> went out to the kitchen, got myself a cup of coffee because I'm not really big on breakfast. Believe it or not, I'm not a big breakfast guy. I don't even remember if I made breakfast that day or not. At nine times out of ten, I didn't. Um, and yeah, I just enjoyed myself. Enjoyed myself for the day. You know, just had a had a great time. I, I, I honestly, should be told, I had a whole street plan for my birthday. I was gonna do, uh, which I may do sometime in the future, Dark Souls 3. Um, but I was only gonna use the club weapon. Only the club weapon from beginning, start to finish. And so that stream definitely will be happening sometime in the future. Um, I have a lot of things coming for you guys, bro. I have so many different ideas. It's crazy. My whole mind is literally like, you know that episode of Spongebob where he has those little Spongebobs in his head just kind of typing shit up? Now granted, my little Spongebobs ain't... <laughs> my little Spongebobs are not going into a ballistic frenzy where shit is crashing down. I pray to God that never happens. Seriously. In my mind, I don't think I can take it. Um, but, I just have so many different ideas that I really just kind of have to lay out on the table. And I was thinking about this, um, I guess this is a little bit of an update video ish kind of not re i mean it kind of is but it's kind of not i'm just i'm just talking to you guys and i like videos like this where I, i'll hardly edit it and i'll just put on some background music because the authenticity the raw is what is the charm behind <laughs> behind some of this stuff so i do have some ideas coming I have a lot of things that I'm labbing, and I keep doing this because my iPad is like right here. This is where I keep a lot of my ideas. Oh, I have to write them down where I start sketching some ideas and I see what the hell I make. Uh, I just have to find one good day, which will probably be tomorrow, because tomorrow, as you can clearly see, I need to get myself a fucking haircut. My lord, it's just like, who the fuck did that to you? And you know, it was crazy. I used to be so insecure about my forehead. Like, I used to be dumb insecure about it, but then I found that a lot of... Some, some girls actually like the big forehead because they, they start asking very interesting questions like, oh, are you African? Are you Nigerian? And part of me in my, man, my mind, I'm just like, what if I just said yes? <laughs> what if I'm just like, yeah, yeah, I am. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm just, I'm black. It's, I'm a black man, but I just, I was born with a gigantic, ginormous forehead, you know? Like, and at first when I started to see it like this, I was like, man, am I, is my hairline receding? Is this like really bad? No, ironically not. I'll go back and look at pictures of me when I was like 10 years old. This forehead has never changed and I've been growing my hair out normally. Just, you know, anyway, anyway, a lot of things are coming to the channel. A lot of ideas that I have, um, shorts that you see, I need you to understand this. I never plan a short ever. There's never like, oh, I'm going to. I plan my videos, and I plan a lot of my my character analysis videos, my season breakdowns, my talking points and stuff like that. Those are planned. The shorts, I will wake up one morning and be like, it will be like, prime example, the Radon second phase one, which <laughs> to me, that's so funny. I woke up, I woke up one day, matter of fact, that one slick might have been planned. Okay, so me and my older brother, we were talking about, at that point, it was only three episodes of The Boys season four. And I went over to his apartment and we were talking about those three episodes. And in the third episode, Homeland who does that where he, he's so pissed off, he just streak he flies off. He just flies off. It's like he's a fucking kid. So then weeks later, I wake up one morning, and this is around the time I'm still labbing. I'm I'm still labbing Radon on again, off again. I haven't done it in, in literally like a week or whatever, so I have to re kind of refresh my mind, I guess, on that. Anyway. Um I was thinking about him and his second phase, and I was just like... 
and I just put them together. I just put them together. That video took all of like 15 minutes to put to 15, 15, 10, like 10 minutes to get the clips, put them together, and upload this shit. Yeah, like 10, 15 minutes. So yeah, I never plan shorts, but like the streams and the videos, those are definitely planned. And I like to, I like to take my time with them because I have a bit of a um, a perfectionist complex, if that makes sense. So I need things to kind of be a certain way. Otherwise, I panic. <laughs> it's just honest to God, I, I fucking panic. Um, so that is really all I came on here to say. I'm still very much alive. The channel's still much, very much alive. Also. Let me check, just, just, you know, just to not embarrass myself further. Okay, okay, yeah, I just wanted to be sure. Um, we, we hit 470 subscribers, and I just want to say thank you all. Thank you guys so much for, for oh my god, I'm about to cry. <laughs> thank you guys so much for that, I, I really do appreciate that. I remember the biggest jump that I had in subs, and I know for a lot of people it's just like, Four to seventy. I got that in a day. Congratulations for knowing four hundred and seventy people. This, this is this is this is a big achievement for me. I remember last year, around the time of my birthday, I uploaded the Get to SM video, and I gained like sixty to seventy subs in like one night. Like I just woke up and I just kept getting notifications of comments and likes and the subs and just they kept rolling. And like that, around that time, I also left my my full-time job because I learned to really kind of take this seriously <laughs> or whatever and I still want to do that now you know we've been streaming we've been well we haven't streamed in like a month but I gotta get back on that there's just there's just so much that I really want to do with this channel I'm still trying to figure out what direction I want to take because there's just so much I do with it you know part of me is like do I split it off into another channel or do I keep everything here I'm not sure I just have so many ideas in there they're literally like we want to come out but i'm like well i gotta figure out which lane for y'all to take let's let's wait but again thank you guys for 470 subscribers thank you guys for still sticking with the channel liking the shorts coming through for the streams and supporting your boy with the video ideas like the 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 oh this ost fits perfectly i'm glad people were really, were really liking that one as well I didn't know if people were gonna like it because of my fucking PC and the performance issues that I had being in the ancient ruins of RAW. But I did get a new GPU, I just need to get a new processor, and then like we are gonna be we're gonna be there. I think that's I think God is like, I don't want you to beat Radanya until you get a new processor. Cause that's the one thing I need to get. I need to get a new processor um for the PC so that it can run a lot better. Thank you guys for for, for coming through and supporting your boy. I'm gonna say that again. Thank you guys for coming through and supporting your boy if you haven't already. Please, please, please go ahead and like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Subscribe to the platform. Subscribe to the dream. I promise you, come next year, you're going to see my black ass somewhere at DreamCon. You're going to see me. You're going to see me. I'm going to go crazy in this last quarter of the year. I made a promise to myself that I was going to do that. I mean, last year we were, at, we were at, what, 250 subs, and now I'm at 470. I'm grateful. Very much grateful for the growth. It's been exponential, and we're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going. Hope somehow, some way. Hopefully, I can hit a thousand by the end of the year. Who knows? <laughs> Maybe we'll see. We'll see. And then another thing, you'll definitely be. I don't. It may actually be tomorrow because I already have the game loaded. I just have to play around with the game capture settings because my game capture, my Elgato game capture, is kapoof. It's gone. I don't. <laughs> I admit, like, so much shit has happened, like, a uh, quick, quick little thing, quick little thing, and now I'll wrap up. I've been able to stream off of my HD, I think it's called HD 60 Plus, right? Hear me, right? That, that's where I was, that's where I was capturing from. El uh, OBS had, saw it, a, a red HD 60, 60 plus super, whatever the hell it, that captures the car. And that's what I've been streaming my Elden Ring and gaming, anything gaming you've been seeing up until this point, it's been on that capture card. I changed GPUs from the 1660 Super to the 30, what do I have? <laughs> the 3060, okay, it's what I can afford right now, bear with me. To the 3060, it's gone. OBS is just like, oh, you've never had it. And I'm like, I know, <laughs> I know I've never had it. 
I was streaming off of a ghost product. I shit you not, because when I change GPUs, like before when I would pull up OBS and it would be on my gaming scene, you can see like it showing the display of the desktop, right? Or the, um, not the desktop, but the, the OBS program. I switch, black screen. I don't, I don't know if there was like an HD 60 plus super whatever installed specifically in that GPU, but I'll tell you this thing, right? I'll tell you this thing right now. That freaked the fuck out of me. I thought I broke something. I was just like, what is happening? And then in my mind, they finally clicked. I'm like, I've never had my game capture. When I moved in 2022, I lost it. I lost it in the move. It was gone. I thought I packed everything with it. I lost it in move. It's gone. It is gone. So thank you guys for watching and supporting your boy on this journey. As I say for the 16th thousandth time. I love you guys. And you will definitely be seeing more of me tomorrow. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Ooh, ooh I like that. A little chilling. Stay tuned.